Well, hello there and welcome back. It's your girl, Stace in the place and the three wild crazy pups are running around here somewhere. They're bound to show up in the video because you know, they can't, <laughs> they could not be left out. Um, anyhow, so today we are gonna do a little unboxing from Pumpworks. Honestly, I don't even know what's in this box. I ordered two things. Um, let's see, what can I tell you? I can tell you that you should subscribe. Um, and I can tell you that I would love for you to comment down below and take a wild guess at what we could be unboxing from homework. Um, but in any case, while we are on our road to a thousand subscribers, I decided that I was gonna let Philly Girl 31 talk me into buying this. Well, she talked me into buying both things. I bought two things from Homeworks. They are both luminaries, but, oh, ah, Lee, this is tricky. Um, but we don't know Ooh, which one this is. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is wild. Okay, da, 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 da. it is the little Halloween Haunted House Luminary. Interesting here. Okay, I'm about to risk it all. And I don't know why, but like the little styrofoam, um, little styrofoam bolts, they just, or balls. Oh my God, now I got all the balls all over me. All the balls all over me. That's why, I guess that's what she said. I don't know, that was inappropriate, I'm sorry. Anyways, that's, that's what popped up in my head. Getting back, back to the, back to the story at hand. So, this is it. It's cute. I am, honestly, I'm shooketh by the size. I'm just going to say it. Oh my gosh. I feel like this is just like an endless uh, list of things that she said. But anyways, um, it's, it's pretty, I don't know. It's smaller than I thought. I thought it was going to be bigger, um, but apparently, supposedly, um, we can fit a four wick candle in here, but I don't know. Okay, so this is the first side and everyone was talking about, oh, look at the moon, the moon is glorious. As you can hear, the three crazy amigos are back there. Um, interesting. And so you can see through like two and two and these two and these two holes um, or windows, sorry. Um, and you can see through these three and you can see through these three and these three. So that's interesting. Um, I do agree with Harry about how like, no matter what angle or which side you look at, like it's gonna be pretty and be like, okay, okay, it looks nice. Um, but I'm curious to see it with the candle inside. And also this is the inside. Hi, Sterling. And this is the bottom. Do you want to say hi? Where you at? Hey, girl. Say hello. Say hi, friends. No, we can't eat the balls. No eating of the styrofoam balls. It's not cool. It's not cool. What do you think? Do you like it? Do you like Harry's haunted house? Do you like it? I think it's cute. What do you think? You think it's cute? But you want to see what a candle? Okay. We're going to go and get a candle for BRB. All right, so we're back. Sterling decided to pick spooky vanilla. Do you like it? Do you like spooky vanilla? Yeah. I know, it smells nice, right? Um, let's see here. Um, so this one, it came with one of the um, candle holders from last year, but we will use it this year nonetheless. <laughs> All right, so Sterling, you wanna stay up here? There you go, hon. There you go, bud. All right, so we're gonna place the candle in there. Goes in there, swell, pretty swell. All right, so watch out, boo. Watch out, baby, we gotta light this up for our friends. We can't light you up, that's not cute. See that, we're not be cute. We are not trying to go to the emergency vet anytime soon, not at all. All right, there we go. Come on, little candle. Okay, 
Ta-da! Sterling, what do you think? Do you like it? Sterling, are you in love? I don't know. I don't know, guys. Sterling doesn't seem impressed. Sterling, do you like it? Look at it. It glows, baby. We can see it. So hopefully, um, with our placement and today's Vanna, <laughs> aka Sterling, even though she's watching Tuck's uh, roll on the floor over here, um, you can see, and we can, here, I'll hold it, and you can rotate it, and you can kind of see like the glimmer of light here. So, I mean, I think that it's very cute. I think that if you're trying to be um, budget conscious, then this is definitely a win. Um, unfortunately, I was silly and I did not realize that the special sale price um, was only for an hour. So I picked it up afterwards, but it was like a seven, I think about seven or eight dollar um, difference. So like not too crazy, but I'm like, man, I could have saved that seven or eight dollars for shipping, but it's cool. It's cool. Um, so many of you may be wondering, what does it look like compared to Bath and Body Works um, Luminary for this year? Sterling, you want to show them? Maybe? Can, can, you, can you jump down so we can see? Do you want to sit down? Okay. All right. She's got a mind of her own, folks. So, ah, this right here is the Bath and Body Works one. Can you scooch? Can you scooch your little booty? Can you scooch your little booty just a little bit? Just a little bit. Thank you. Thank you, man. Thank you. Um, so here they are. Um, so you can kind of see and get the proportional difference here. Hopefully you can see the sizing difference um, if we angled the camera correctly. But yeah, I mean, I feel like you could probably put this one inside of this one almost. It's just a little narrow. Um, but you know, again, I think it all comes down to sizing and what it is that you really, um, want and desire for your home. Um, if you want to have a big display and kind of have a little bit more like spookiness and a little bit more color then the Bath and Body Works one, uh, maybe more of your purview versus the Homeworks one, like it's cute, it's complex or not complex, it is compact, but it still has a lot of design and it's like a nice neutral vibe. So I feel like even with this one, um, wow, Sterling, apparently Sterling can jump. Um, <laughs> so <laughs> as you can see here now that Avanna Sterling has left, um, you can see a little bit more of the sizing. But I think that this one is great for if you want to put it like on your coffee table um, or, you know, you're tight for space and you just want something that looks like nice, cute, a little spooky, but not too much. Um, you know, this one is great. If you want something that's like big, blah, blah, boom, and it glows in the dark, then you might want to go with this one. And so this one retails for $250, which is a huge difference between this one that is retailing. I believe last time I checked, it was like $79, maybe, I think. It was somewhere in the 70s. Um, so it's a huge price difference, which shows... Um, do I feel like this one is worth almost 80 bucks? I mean, if it came with a candle, then I would say yes, because I feel like most of the um, candle holders that come with a candle, and apparently Winnie does as well, um, they're usually about 50, 60 bucks, so they also come with a candle, and this one didn't. Um, and so maybe it's because it's ceramic and not the resin or regular, Wow, guys. Really? Really, Winnie? Are you are you that upset with homeworks because you wanted an extra candle? Yeah? Yeah? Are you trying to tell Harry? Like, what's going on here? She's she's a mess. Um, but anyhow, um, I think with this one, if it came with a candle for the 77 or 79, then I would feel a little more, I don't know, I would feel more justified in the price, but... At the same time, you know, 
inflation, things are going up. Do I think this is a great buy? Yes, if you got it on the little sale and you really wanted a haunted house, but you don't want something that's like huge and gonna take up a lot of storage room because I foresee this one taking up a lot of room, then I think this one is a great compromise. Um, I just personally feel like it's all based on personality, what you're interested in. Um, of course, crazy me, um, I have both. Also, it's Philly Girl 31's fault, if I didn't say that before. It's your fault, boo, because you talked me into it. Um, but I am happy with the purchase. I just wish it was a little bit cheaper, but you know, it's fine. People and, you know, people down below want ice water, but they don't always get it. So it's fine. We can, you know, if beggars were horses, wishers would ride, but it's cool. Um, but anyhow, that is our Haunted House Luminary from Homeworks. Um, and yeah, I guess we will catch you in the next one where I will show you the other Luminary we picked up from Homeworks. This is what happens. Yeah, is this what y'all are doing in the back of the videos? Yeah? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wilding. You guys are wilding. Off the chain. Just off the chain. Winnie, are you the ringleader? Are you serious right now? I told y'all. The girl is crazy. Crazy.